Hey everyone, Video Game Lover here, and welcome to my Let's Play of Gunstar Heroes. As you may have heard on my Twitter, that this game turned 25 years old. And the reason I'm playing this for you is this is one of my favorite Genesis running gun games of all time, next to, of course, Dr. Harkly. Without further ado, let's begin. Okay. We have a choice between free shot or big shot. Free shot makes you shoot while moving. Big shot makes you stand still. I'm gonna go with big shot, which is Gunstar Blue. So it's a blind. And I'm going to use the ball. And we'll do these levels. We're doing them in order. Okay. There's a weapon that I really want. It's the fire weapon. Oh, and, it, and, oh, and we got it! Alright, this weapon is amazing. It's the chase ball. This is really meant for the fifth guy. It makes your... Ow. Oh. Um, it does a lot of damage. There's so much shit going on. hi -ya! I love this one. hi -ya! Ghost of Red. So ya! The blue is like, hi -ya! A little bit loose with a joystick. Not as accurate as the. Uh, not as accurate as the D pad. But the problem is, when I'm shooting, I stay still, so I have to <laughs> constantly jump. Anything. Well, like I said, this gun is... A lot of people say the Chaser is the best, which is the Follow... The Follow Star, and then the Laser. But personally, the Chaser is very good, especially for, like, the sixth level. But, um, it's not... Sometimes it doesn't hit bosses very well. Alright, look at this boss. Look at this boss right here. Watch, watch him die in four seconds. There you go, totally. Let me not get too. And the good news is the fire actually gets rid of the bullet. Ah. See, it's just a little loose. Alright, we're almost done with level one. Level one is very short. Kill these bees. You don't want nothing out with them. They just lose health. Oh yeah. There we go. Ugh, fuck off, beast. Alright. Anyway, here's the boss. King. Oh yeah, dude, just use this, and you're good. And make sure you shoot him to avoid the bullets. You're, you're gonna be dead. <laughs> He's alright, almost dead. This guy, please. Thank you. I have so much health, so it's not even... It didn't even matter. And that's level 1 for you. They're blasting off again! Hoya! <laughs> okay, next! Gunstar Green stage. Basically, Gunstar Green got uh, brainwashed by the dictator. This is one of the most iconic levels of the game. You're gonna find out why. Okay. First off, I forgot to tell you, man, this game just looks amazing for the Sega Genesis. I mean, this is, in my opinion, one of the best-looking Genesis games out there. Ow. That, 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 that. Hey. 
Really? 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 Are you? Okay, now he's dead. All right, thank you. Get rid of this. Now we're going sideways. Okay. What? Doesn't do a whole lot, but you know, I don't like to get hit that much in this game. Bullets, not so much. I mean, guns start red and blue are so goddamn strong. I mean, they're way, I mean, these guys are, are like kids. And they can withstand one bullet, unlike Bill Richard from Contra. How the hell is that possible? Oh, dang it, I think they're super human. Whatever. Okay. We're almost done with this level. Bosses in the history of any running gun game. Here we go. The seventh force. His first force. Uses his arm to hit you. And he just runs. And he does that too. So be careful. Alright, there goes that force. Next. Okay, so he's using the tail. This one is a little bit annoying, but the tail actually does a lot of damage if it hits you. Okay. That one's done. Oh, God, this one. Okay, this is the reason why I had the fire weapon. It, this fire gets rid of, like, most of his attacks. So you're gonna be in good shape. This one is definitely his worst attack. Like, it's actually pretty devastating. There you go. Next. Oh, this one. Okay. Now, I want to keep this in mind. In normal mode, you fight five. In extra mode, you fight all seven of his forms. I'm just saying, just want to let that out there. Oh. And there you go. Alright, his last form. Okay, let's give me the Jaguar. This one's pretty easy. Uh oh. Doing a different attack. Oh shit! Almost got run over. And we're done. That's the seventh force. And Gunstar Green. And level two. Okay, level three. Orange is love. And this old kind of annoying. Especially this first part. You know, I just actually, I'm less playing this game. I haven't even told you guys what the plot is. So basically what's going on is that many years ago, there was this powerful robot called Golden Still. And he's apparently a, ma a robot that could destroy the entire galaxy. Well, we were able to stop him 
like many years ago, but now there's a big tear and wants to revive him. To do so, he needs four pieces. Oh, maybe that's where they got the idea of Transformers Dark of the Moon. Okay, interesting. Legit hit me. I was like, what, a meter away from that thing. You want to be in this corner, by the way, when the ship leaves. For some odd reason, if you're like on the left, you'll get hurt for some reason. I don't know why. Okay, we got a very powerful mid boss. Look at this mid boss. Oh my god. What are we gonna do? How am I gonna beat this guy? Anything. Okay. Destroy this. Got some health. Destroy that. More health. Hey, I'm Bison. I'm gonna fight a little mini boss. We find him later in the game, and believe me, he's actually pretty annoying. <laughs> oh, damn it! Okay, what? Okay, here's Arch. Arch could actually be pretty devastating with some of his attacks, so be very careful. I love his theme, by the way. Gross is okay. He's almost dead. Okay, bye bye. Thanks for coming. Okay, you want to just throw me? And he's dead. Ah oh, man, I wasn't able to fall off the plane. It's like a funny little animation of you. So if you fall off the plane, Gunstar Blue lands all weird. That's level three. Uh, uh, okay. Black slow. Oh my god. Anyone who has played this game, you know damn well what this level is all about. The infamous Dice Mate. Now, I don't want to waste anyone's time. So this is going to be the one instance where I'm going to use a safe state. I know I don't like... You... I really don't like using safe state. Especially on let play. Because I feel like I'm cheating. But... Be, yeah, wait for me. But because... This is the dice maze, and there is a part, not that it's hard, it's not hard, but there's a part where one of the, where if I were to land on a spot, it will say go back, and I'm not doing that. So hopefully, it's not designed like that. So, let's start throwing the dice. Uh, which one is this? Timer on of oh, this There we go. Okay. 
Alright. Throw it again, and let's see who we're gonna fight next. Uh, let's see. Oh my god! It's the hardest boss in gaming history! Damn! I didn't know I was gonna beat him. God, that boss is so fucking hard. Okay, <laughs> enough of melon deer. Alright. Throw it again. Okay, this is the one boss I have trouble using the chaser. But thanks to this weapon, it makes my life a hell of a lot easier. See, I kill him uh, very easily. With the chaser, it mainly focuses on that wall thing rather than the bosses. It's kind of annoying. Uh, this one I think is a little challenge if I remember, yeah. Let me... okay. Ah. Okay. Let's see what's up next. Oh, uh, which one is this one? Oh, this one. Okay, destroy the core. Okay. Wait, what the hell? Why did... Ah, whatever. Oh, shit. Okay, no. Alright. Alright, there you go. Okay. Now, you might be asking yourself, so we're we'll going to do this real fast. I want to tell you something. This is entirely random. It's just, I'm lucky that I'm getting three. Because let me tell you something. This is beyond random. Okay, we're in the park. Okay. So, Super Gondola. This, this is pretty easy. Now, like I said, I don't want to risk it. Please forgive me, everyone. I'm going to use a safe state. Hopefully, I don't get a two. Okay, I got a one. Okay, that's fine. I got a one, so... I just, I, it's just that I don't want to go back. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I don't want to go back and... Waste your guys' time. You know what I'm saying? I, do, I, I don't want to do it. Alright. Let me say, say it again just to make sure we I don't get a one. Ah, see? Ah! Yeah, see? It ain't happening. No. Not happening in my watch. I'm not that stupid. What? No. No, 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 no. You're not forcing it on me. No. Thank you. You ain't forcing me, game. Ha, ha, ha. Alright. This is the one time I'm using safe state. Okay, I'm not using no safe state anymore. I, know, I just want to not do this dice made now. Oh. Alright, here's the boss. Black. He's pretty easy. Just gotta make sure when, where he lands. Okay, so yellow, that's fine. I'm gonna make this spot. Okay, whoa! Uh oh. Fire. Whoa. And he's dead. Thanks for coming, Black. Like well, I said, this gun is so damn good. Well, it only took me just 20 minutes to get through this. Well, obviously, that's because of the dice. It would have taken me like 25 minutes. Or Watch out! He throws a fake uh uh crystal. Yeah, give me give me the real one, bitch. Hoo ya! All right, stage five. 
Yeah, he, while all this is going, he gets tied up. The Empire came and Yellow got kidnapped. So now we have to give him the gems. Okay, this goal is extremely chaotic. And this is kind of one of the weaknesses about this weapon. Because I'm constantly... You're constantly moving, I gotta jump and do... Jump and kick a lot. Ow. So hopefully things don't go... Things go well. Let me get rid of that. Bye bye. Ah oh, man, I think it's too much of a beat right now. He gave me a little bit of help. Oh my god. Yeah, see, they just throw an onslaught at you. Oh. Now we're back to just him, and he's dead already. Run. Oh shit. You gotta kill those guys, by the way. You can't let them live. Cause they'll, like, throw bombs at you. Okay. Ow. Why am I gonna pick up these boxes? That's kinda weird. Ah. Okay. We're actually getting close to being halfway uh we're halfway done. Next is the yellow people. They're gonna be after us. Right, now we gotta see. This is the only one of the only parts of this game that actually there is a slowdown. I mean that's still impressive that I mean that's impressive that the game didn't even have to slow down and even begin with. You know what I'm saying? Oh you know that was bad. Ooh, that was real bad I got thrown. Hopefully, yeah, you just tried to be... One die, please. Die, please. Thank you. All right, the last part. Be very careful, um, because of these things. These blade things can actually do some damage you run into them. So, what I normally do is kick three times and then just walk. After this one. Okay, now one, two, three, walk. Ah, oh, man. Uh, let me walk for now. Okay. Two, three, four, walk. One, two, three, four, walk. See? One, two, three, four. Walk. There you go. And we're done. This is the boss. He loves to dance. Just kidding. <laughs> it's that bike. Okay. His first phase is pretty easy. It's the second phase. It's, hey, look at that. He did his own version of the Psycho Crusher. He doesn't hurt you when he runs into you, just only that move. Ah, man. Okay. I also want to pinpoint something. If you were to die in this ball, it's going to do this level over again. Just saying. Okay, so far so good. Alright, now I can really train this out. He, what is he doing? He's going to his corner and start attacking me. Alright, we're good. We're good. What the, I'm actually surprised I whooped his ass in the second phase. The second phase tends to get me a lot. Alright, so that's the end of stage 5. Now he's trying to shoot yellow. So we have no choice but to give him the poor gem.
This part's pretty fucking funny, watch this. This little guy on tied yellow, and Bison gets mad. I forgot, if his real name is, I think it's Smash. And <laughs> he's just beaten up by these. time for level six this is one of the longest levels of the game now hopefully I get the laser and the reason for this is because this weapon is pretty damn shitty in this level because uh, well, 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 well because I gotta keep like my distance it's a little weird Okay, we're not gonna get nope. Oh, it's just we already got one. That'll be fine. Okay. I could just use this. Let me see if I can use this to help me out a little bit. Doing so damn. And just like, you remember when I said how if you were to die, you'd start to go over again? Well, that's the case with this, uh, well, the first half. Uh, timer on again, a midget version. And, yeah, we don't have time. Yeah, this thing is Oh, no. No, 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 no. We're gonna have to do Okay, good. I'll take this for now. This is the, the chaser. See? It chases everything, every target. The problem is, it just doesn't do a whole lot of damage, that's the thing, but it, it'll definitely... Help us out for this level in particular. Oh, man. I remember this case being this fucking bad in this level. Okay, I just got real fucked up. And that's actually pretty bad. Oh, God. Hey, I think I might be regretting it. Pretty fun. I mean, it's really cool. They actually added like a shim up level. But the thing is, is that it has a lot of pressure that you can't really die. There's no checkpoints in this level. So that's why you have to just be very, very careful on this deck. Ooh, that was bad. Oh, 
We ain't close to being done with this exact game. Don't want to jinx this, but I think I have enough health to get this. Game. You're gonna get hit, bro. You're gonna get a bullshit ass. Ooh, that was bad. I think they give me health again if I remember. Whatever. Yeah, they do. Hopefully I get my weapon back though, for the ball. I really don't want to chase it for the sixth ball. No, 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 no. Now be very careful on this part. There's missiles that come out of nowhere and they do a lot of damage. So I gotta really focus here as it's coming up, like right now. We're good. Now, guess what we're gonna fight? Yeah, if this level wasn't annoying enough, you fight the seven force again. But this time, he's going all out with his, with his form. There's the gun uh, form that you didn't get to see. Hopefully, he does the bird. Oh, okay, here we go. So you get to see all of them. The green health, dramatic health. Really cool. Oh man. No, 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 no. Shoot, shoot, boy. Stay away from me! Stay away from my ass! Beat the shit. Alright, we're done. Okay, so that's the long part. Definitely one of the most annoying parts of this level. Now, hopefully, I can get my weapon. And I. Alright, we're back in this. Careful. Now right here, they're gonna give you an ass load of power. Okay. Alright, now we can just jump kick our way. Okay! Here's the boss. Let's say this boss is challenging. By the way, I forgot to show you this. If you press B and C at the same time, you actually block. Let's do it. Okay, it's not working. Oh shit, he's already doing this move? What the fuck? That was. Like, that's supposed to be. Okay. He got some fly kick too. Down the key. Oh man. Well, he's really being a fucking jerk. This is all the thing I said about. Okay, this is actually not looking good. This is actually really not looking good. Oh my god. Alright, there we go. This first form is pretty annoying. Be careful, he's gonna try to attack you one more time. Alright. Now, this second form is pretty easy. This is pretty much the core of his shit that we're playing. There we go. It's just so much damage. There we go. Fuck it. Why am I not doing this? Why am I not blocking? What the fuck? There's a... Okay, there we go. I got it. See? Very weird to do it. But now, we fight the boss. And hey, look! It's Vector Man before he became Vector Man. No joke, I first saw it. I locked my eyes off because I was like, Vector Man? When did you, when were you in Gunstar Heroes? He has a pretty easy pattern, though. He does that, his next attack, that, and you're good. Once you know his pattern, he's, he's a good guy. An absolute good And then Vector Man remembers he's Vector Man, so he ends up running away, and he right into the core, and he dies. And that's why Vector Man has been here in nearly 22 years.
Alrighty. Well, what's the last level in the game? And this last level is pretty much a boss boss. Alright. For this first boss, just duck and shoot. That's all you have. Hopefully, he doesn't land right on. Uh, he would be very. No, well, what's with the lag up here? There we go. Did some damage, but I'm good. Uh, this, well, if you have this weapon, you're pretty much good. Good to go. Alright, be careful here. Alright, there's some health. How did I get here? Back in. Okay. Now we hear a trip from this part. Alright. Now we fight pink once again in this very weird, uh, the pink lobster, yeah. She likes to jump, so when she gets, when you get, she gets near, do that. Okay, boom. Boom. By the way, you have infinite continues, I've got to tell you that. Alright, now, she's gonna block. For that, you just gotta uh, get up on her close. I'm gonna try to go and get a tap by her bubble. Alright, there you go. We beat her. And they blast off for good. Never be seen them again. Alright, next is Orange. Oh boy, Orange could be actually pretty vicious on your... Um... On... This rematch, just say. Alright, here he is. I'm gonna stand right up here for now. He can be, he can do some major damage. Look how much health he has. Yeah, 5,000. Wow. Okay, so we're gonna do this. Okay, that's fine. Do whatever. Uh -oh. Very nice. Be very generous. He has not done a lot of moves like such as jumping up here, trying to charge me. Wow, he's being very. He is not, okay. Here he comes. Yeah, see that move. Really doesn't help because I'm in the fix shot too. All right, being. Wow, he was very generous. Okay, next is black. All right. Ah, uh, 281 health, so we are <laughs> amazing to go. Black is pretty easy with this weapon. All you gotta do is just shoot him up high, and then shoot down any other attacks he has coming up. See, like that. When it's health deplete, that means you're nearby. Oh, see, it's like. Alright. Now I gotta be careful with this. Huh, doesn't that look like from Contra Hardcore? Yeah, so now we know where they got the idea of that attack. I mean, Kanami. This game came out one year before that. Okay, the last one guy, Green. Woo! Green can be pretty tough. Now, if you had the lightsaber weapon, which is the fire lightning, fire laser attack, this boss is an absolute joke. All uh, right, here we go. Yeah, he taunts you too. Black, come on, bitch. Oh, black, black, black. Black, come on, come on. Come on. Oh my 
Oh my, okay, you wanna play like a freaking asshole, let's do it then. Alright, this is all he does for most of the boss. The thing he's trying to do is get near you so he can throw you. That's kind of the thing you gotta be very careful. Is he's trying to throw you. And his throws do a lot. Whoa. Wow. Ah, see. I got a lot of health, but I don't want it to really lose this. That's the rather fight. Okay, you you know what? Okay, you really start. Okay, you're really pissing me off. You're really pissing me off. Okay, let me run away from this guy. He is. Just okay, just one more dose. And he's gone. There he is. And what comes out of him is the control device that they use. Hello. Now what he does, he's gonna try to eat the crystals on his own, but it rejects him. And it ends up going to gold and silver. Fun fact, gold and silver actually, not him, uh, the guy that brought the fight, actually appears in Garden Heroes, if I recall. Apparently they're in the same universe. I'm not too sure. I mean, it is made by treasure. So we got okay. We're gonna get some help. Now, the little gimmick that um, treasure games have. Normally, you attack the final boss fight. Well, that's not the case here. You're actually gonna attack the gem. I want to tell you, this weapon did a lot of damage. Alright, go on silver. Just dodge whatever he has coming up to you and just destroy the gem. Stand there. Very rarely he actually makes a sound, believe it or not. He actually does talk, but it's very rare. Okay, so wait for me. Alright, so now. Now we can really do some damage. Low down. You like go away, please. He's almost dead. And. That's it. That's the final boss. So I said, very easy final boss, especially at the weapon. So yeah, uh, that's Gunstar Heroes. You know, it's um pretty chill. That's because I've been in this game numerous of times. So I know what to do. Uh, you have infinite continues. So this game isn't like the hardest game until you play up like on hard mode or expert mode. But normal mode, pretty chill. So what ends up happening is he flies away, and we gotta stop him. We have awakened the terrible destructor. And now they regret doing this. Ah! What are we going to do with no weapons? I'm sorry that I have brought trouble upon you all. Even though I was controlled by the Empire, I'm going to make amends for the thing that I have done to you, all of you. So that's Gunstar Heroes. Yeah, the game ends on a cliffhanger. I hope you all enjoyed this little let's play. I mean, I can't believe this game is 25 years old. I mean, that's just crazy. I'm actually amazed I beat this game in like 40 minutes. I know you all are going to be like, like, you use that safe state. That's what I mean. Well, like I said, it depends. If I do very well, I could beat this game in like 40 minutes. But if I... It all depends on that dice level. That dice level is still annoying. But yeah, 
really awesome game. One of the best Sega Genesis games out there. It's just an all-time classic. Phenomenal graphics, great music, phenomenal gameplay. One of the best co-op games on the Genesis. It's just amazing. I mean, and what's crazy is this was tre one of Treasure's first games they ever made. That's a crazy thing. But yeah, I'm glad I let's play this game for you. Um, thank you all for watching. I uh, love this game so much. They made a sequel, Gunstar Superheroes, which I never got around to play, actually. I played it once before, but i got to try it again. So anyway, guys, this is Video Game Order 58. I'll see you guys on my next video. Peace.